What's up, <clears throat> Hangover Gang, man? It's been a while. It's been a while since you've seen me. I know it, because <laughs> it's been a while since I've seen y'all. All right, man, we got Tom McDonald with Dirty Money. And I want to give a shout out to Hangover Gang, because you guys have always been the foundational staple of this channel, because you guys gave me the confidence to actually do music reactions. So if anybody's still here, thank you. Thank you. And also, special thanks to Tom and Nova. You know, I know they watch the channel as well. So let's get it. Black Lives on. Hold up. You seem like you played a little bit, so let's go. They're angry that they'll never shut me up. I'm making more noise. Turn me up or turn me down. It's your choice. Black lives only matter when they got a corpse to exploit. Because the media made millions off the protests for George Floyd. Interesting. Yeah, uh, that's always been something that's been a staple when, when talking about um, when it all got exposed, basically. That's always been a staple of it. So now something as uh, innocent as Black Lives Matter became. Uh, became a financial revenue stream for a few people. So making money off the dead bodies of black men, huh? That's what we own. It's only matter when they got a corpse to exploit because the media made billions off the protests for George Floyd. That's called ad revenue. They make cash selling you. All the crap in the ads where they broadcast news. Hmm, I like the way he did that, man. Let me go back. That's called ad revenue. They make cash selling you. Ad revenue. Cash selling you. <laughs> the crap in the ads where they broadcast news. Who the network full of liars got investment capital and segment sponsored by Pfizer and the Freedom Fighters. I feel like the Ooh. He going a little bit deeper now. Tom Tom always seems to kind of skim over the tr over the truth seeking like songs that he does, but it seems like he's just diving a little bit of deep. He diving a little bit deeper. All right now, Tom. They might come get you. They make cash selling you all the crap in the ads where they broadcast news. Ooh, the network full of liars got investment capital and segments sponsored by Pfizer and the Freedom Fighters. I feel like the left just plans them to infiltrate the right. It's extensive planning. Then it happens overnight. It's impressive branding. Make a million off of shirts that say, let's go branding. It's a wow, 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 wow. So it almost sounds like he's talking about the way the media influences, uh, influences people to join these movements. So he's already called out Black Lives Matter, and now he's calling out the other people too. The cash grab, everyone's a lab rat. Amazon made billions of dollars from sanitizer and black masks, and that's the oh. night. It's impressive. All right, let's get it. It's been a while since I did Tom McDonald, so I'm a little bit, I'm a little bit rusty. All right. It's a brand and make a million off of shirts that say let's go brand, and it's a cash grab. Everyone's a lab rat. Amazon made billions of dollars from sanitizer and black masks, and that's that. Funny how the terror. Interesting. I like the way when he uh I like the way he mentioned at tack. <laughs> at tack. Cash grab, everyone's a lab rat. Amazon made billions of dollars from sanitizer and black masks, and that's that. Funny how the terrorists who at tag always come from places that are oil rich and have gas. Democrats, they don't give a damn. What is this about? Our military trapped in the Middle East can't get them out. Heroes are the ones who had the constitution written down. Y'all are using hero while describing Kyle Rittenhouse. Wow. Uh oh. Kyle Rittenhouse a hero? Nah, mm, I'm, I, I, I kind of personally, I kind of choose not to pay attention to that stuff. I just think that's, uh, that kind of news is distracted. I don't know how, I don't particularly know how legit it is with Kyle Rittenhouse, but I say anything that the media chooses to uh, pay attention to, we probably need to be looking somewhere else for the truth. You know what I mean? But I like that rhyme scheme that um, Tom did where he was emphasizing all the at tack, black mask, at, 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 like that. And the way he pronounced at tack just to make that thing rhyme, that was pretty cool. I like that. Let's go back. Democrats, they don't give a damn. What is this about? Our military trapped in the Middle East can't get them out. Heroes are the ones who had the Constitution written down. Y'all are using hero while describing Kyle Rittenhouse. One cent, two cent, three cents, four. We get less and they get more. That mix down was crazy. Since four, we get less and they get more. By insult since we were born, they want money. We want dirty more. dollars, fill their pockets while our coffins fill the ground. They make profits, solving problems they create to keep us down. Dirty money. <laughs> I 
don't like that. <laughs> Dirty money, chi-ching. Just, 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 you know, giving us something cute. To... <laughs> hey, Tom, got to give you a shout out. Got to give you a shout out on the way you designed that hook. That breakdown, that build up into the hook. And then right there when it turned up, when the guitars riffing started coming in, you put that, we want war. I like that. I like that. It definitely sets the tone for the hook. It gets the head bobbing. They make profits, solving problems. They create to keep us down. Dirty money. Dirty money. I don't want your dirty money. They might kill me for the song. It's all classified intelligence. Don't need to go to war to secretly be getting benefits. When mm. Russia launches rockets, we condemn them. But there's evidence a U.S. politician owns the screws they're assembled with. Mm. Ain't no war on drugs. It's economic. Sell his profit. Our prisons are privately owned. Illegal marijuana just means kids smoking weed turn the dollars in their pockets. Let's be honest. Domestic threats in comparison to nuclear powers who hate the West is embarrassing. Still, we label truckers in the convoy as terrorists and confiscate donations. We have no idea where it is. A pipe. Interesting. That's one thing I always wondered right there. I'm gonna take back this hook. I'm gonna take back and play this from the beginning. Uh, because there was a lot to unpack right there, but let's let them let's let them cook. For the song, it's all classified intelligence. Don't need to go to war to secretly be getting benefits. When Russia launches rockets, we condemn them, but there's evidence a U.S. politician owns the screws they're assembled with. Ain't no war on drugs, it's economic. You make money off an inmate, every jail cell is profit. Our prisons are privately owned. Illegal marijuana just mean kids smoking weed turn the dollars in their pockets. Let's be honest. Domestic threats in comparison to nuclear powers who hate the West is embarrassing. Still, we label truckers in the convoy as terrorists and confiscate donations. We have no idea where it is. A pipeline. Leaks, price of gas goes higher. Stock market crash, everybody gets fired. Economy is weak while we trying to beat a virus. One trillion dollars in debt to China. We sell he really calling it out. I remember talking about it. I remember talking about it that Tom need to go. He, he you know, he don't need to go too deep. I kind of got an idea of what Tom McDonald knows. You know what I'm saying? If you on that truth seeking cold you know what i'm saying we already know what he on you know what i mean so that that right there mm, if he had just mentioned the name boy tommy tom mcdonald boy he have a target on his back boy he is weak while we trying to beat a virus one trillion dollars in debt to china we celebrate the smallest battles we're winning so they can publish the headline that's gonna fuel the vision but if we champion the crumbs then it's crumbs that we're giving and we don't make any progress we're stuck at the beginning one cent, two cent, three cents, four. We get less and they get more. Uh. My insult since we were born. They want money. We want Dirty more. dollars fill their pockets while our coffins fill the ground. They make profits, solving problems. They create to keep us down. Dirty money. Man, I really like that guitar. I really like that guitar. I like how that dirty money kind of matches that same that same key that the guitar is on. Dun, 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 dun. Like <laughs> I've been listening to a lot of uh Stevie Ray Vaughan and you know Eric Clapton and those guys. So my my ears for the guitar strings are coming are getting better. But uh yeah, let's continue to let them cook. Keep us down. That's a good way to end the song, personally. Our coffins fill the ground. They make profits, solving problems. They create to keep us down. Dirty money. Dirty money. I don't want your dirty money. Ooh, boy. 
What, Shalom? My cat want to get out. I like the song. I like the song. Um, definitely in that political um, spectrum that he died, likes to do. It's been a while since we heard a political track with Tom. Um, Tom been on his pop thing, you know what I mean? But anyway, um, I get a song about a good solid 8 out of 10. Um, I feel like these, you know, just my personal take, I really feel like songs like this, we need a third verse. You know what I'm saying? I think we really need a third verse just to bring it all back full circle. Um, and because uh, I like it, you know what I mean? You know, I want to hear Tom spit some more. Uh, musically, beautiful mi uh, mix down. Beautiful mix down. There's a lot of stuff we need to talk about in there. Definitely. Um, stuff that we can't say on a digital plantation that is what we got here. But, you know, there's definitely a lot to unpack in that. Um, but with that being said, did y'all join my reaction? Um, I know I don't break it down as much as I used to, but I think when I started, Tom was very lyrical to me. So I felt like I needed to break it down. But this one here is pretty straightforward. Not a lot to elaborate on, at least personally for me. Um, but with that being said, shout out to Tom McDonald, Nova. And uh, I forgot the other guy's name, Jared. <laughs> and uh, shout out to Hangover Gang as well. Hope you guys liked it. Let me know in the comment section how you guys feel. Is there any Tom songs that you guys want to hear? All right, I'll catch you guys later, man. Peace.